Hi everyone, I'm Cinderay9. Welcome back to Let's Play Jade Cocoon. Blind. As we're now in the Dragonfly Forest of the Netherworld, we see a completely new enemy, so let's try to capture it. Because <laughs> it seems like I need to merge the my minions more that way they can either get some additional levels some better stats I don't know because that last fight was pretty difficult the one with the boss we start off with the miss good job <clears throat> wow you're fast if you get to go twice like that Jeez. so <laughs> So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show off some of some of these monsters. Oh, it's flat out killed you. Oh well. I'm going to show off these monsters and then I might do some grinding off screen. I haven't really decided yet. Level 14 plus 34 HP plus 2 mana plus 1 to everything. So that's good. Plus 1 to all stats. I'll definitely take that. Depending on just how this stuff goes. Same guy. Seems to be a high evade minion. I would like to capture you though. See, even with the uh, advantage we have, the uh elemental advantage it's still doing a lot of damage oh perfect just what I needed good uh, and the problem is you're only gonna get so much experience out of these minions as well that's the that's where I see because at some point and we've seen this earlier in the in the LP at some point the minions are gonna hit a wall just because they're, they're a higher level than the minions of the, that are here. I just wanted the theme to play. And with that, because... Because you can only do so much leveling anyway... It's not like you could become a, a, a. It's not like you could become powerful enough to to take the bosses with no sweat. At least that's what it feels like. And another thing that uh, another reason that is is because the wall isn't that high. Three hundred and twelve HP. You've got to be joking me. I definitely want to capture you. <laughs> uh, yeah, we're gonna make this into our favor. And fire attack. Good. Again. Oh, you critted. Darn it. I didn't want the crit. Yeah, level up. Plus one to everything but magic defense, plus 17 HP, plus three mana. Oh, yay, more of them. Don't know if you can take two at once, but. There, there was just this big difficulty spike last episode that I just can't get over. I just... I know balancing a game is hard. That's why I'm not... I try not to be overly critical when it, uh, when it comes to games because there's a lot that goes into a game. I know it's hard. I can't code. I mean, I know some basic coding, but... You know, putting together a game, I can't do that. <laughs> so, uh, always remember that when you're playing a game. T 
to, to be, uh, not respectful, but remember just how difficult it is for, for a game. Now, with that being said, I still try to try to look at things critically and give suggestions or ju just what I notice as a gamer. Here you had this big difficulty spike in in the game with the boss. Even the minions are really starting to hurt at this point. And it didn't feel like they were they really eased you into that. Cuz everything up until we got to the Netherworld here was pretty not simple but uh it, it just it, it wasn't that difficult now that minion just hit levant for 50 damage you can only take two of those shots he doesn't level up you have to get those walnut things which um i don't see you know a place to buy or anything like that so you're kind of out of luck there. Um, can't cast that. Oh well, we can cast this. It's. I just feel it's a big jump in difficulty, and not completely fair to the player. Those are just my thoughts, and I don't want you to faint. So. Or ain't knocked out or whatever it is. So I feel like you will have to spend some time leveling up your minions or merging them. But the problem is you can't go back and get minions now. <laughs> You're stuck in this place. So it's not like you have a lot of options to get uh, to get more minions to merge. And with any game with RPG elements, I, I always feel like that's a big, a big no-no to me. You don't make it where the player can't go back. Yes, you have the point, like point of no return, but that's usually at the very end of the game. I mean, the very end of the game. Because if the player's not strong enough and they don't have a way to go back and get stronger, or a good way to go back and get stronger. Then, ugh. Forgot to heal. I wanted to heal. Oh, and you go first! So that's great. Havant's almost dead. Hooray. <coughs> if you don't give the player a chance to go back and maybe correct some mistakes now that they have more knowledge of the game, then you're saying either A, uh, um, makes it easier to kill two legged enemies and slightly more difficult for them to score to score hit. Sure. We'll do that. Then they're just stuck. Which isn't good. So where does that leave us? Well it leaves us with the minions we have, basically. And just trying to make it work. Like, these guys with their 312 HP. They're not very fast, so I, I suppose that is in your favor. I suppose I should catch another one of you, even though you need the experience. And that goes back to the thing I said near the beginning of this LP. No, we can't risk it. We can't risk Levant getting knocked out. So. That you have to choose between cash and and getting experience, which should never be the case. You should be able to get both at the same time. Plus one to all stats, which is great. Plus 15 HP, plus four mana. We'll definitely take that. And because of how this is gone, we'll need to go back to town. So... Uh, it's just a warning to any of you that end up uh, playing this game. Everybody, this is a person, like a blind person's uh, 
Not that I'm blind, I can't see, but this is a blind LP. So, uh, remember that perspective. If you're a veteran of this game, you know the ins and outs, and uh, maybe have some, some great combinations of minions. You're privy to that knowledge. Think about if you're playing this I game for the first time, like I am. My warning is, you're I going to be maybe kind of stuck like I am. I guess the only things I can recommend is try to catch the minions in the forest that you're in um, and make it work. Did I want to capture? Oh yeah, because Levant was about to be knocked out. <laughs> and that's my my only So you have great on uh, your magic attack and magic defense. You're also kind of slow. Let me merge these two together. Plus two speed. See, and even when you merge, you're only getting slight boost. And, uh, and you see, now it's really fast, but it gets slightly more. It gets quite a bit more defense. So I guess this would be a good merge, but. You lose out on the huge defense this has. It's not like you're taking the average of both minions. This is something I've noticed now. It's not like you're taking the average of both minions and throwing them together. You're just taking, because this one has high defense, you get a lot of defense for this minion. But it only goes up to 23. You're missing out on 15 defense. And the speed, this is 35, this is 20, so it goes down to 33. You lose a little bit of defense. Now uh, the HP kind of equals out, you get a ton of HP. So it's just, I think you have to do a lot of merging to get that, that minion you're looking for. I think I lucked out with a uh, Rad Mage or Water Minion. He ended up very well, I think. He's got great speed at 35. The only thing really kind of low is his magic defense, but even that's really good. So. Uh. Guess we'll go back. What. Like I said, if. If we. If I really hit the wall. And it just doesn't look like it's going anywhere. I'll try to get some levels off screen. Maybe that'll that'll fix something. That's why I left this save way back. I may have to start way further back and maybe try to get some minions and do a lot of merging and maybe try that. Uh, in any case. Let's go back to the forest and give it another shot. Uh, thanks to uh, Desk in the comments for uh, letting me know. So that if minions kind of look like they're asleep, they're not really doing doing anything. That if you walk, not run, by them, you can get by without getting into fights. Which that's good to know. I don't think there's anything this way if it mimics the other forest, but I still want to take a look. Now the minions aren't respawning, which really worries me, because if that's the case, which it might not be, if I just exit and re-enter, the minions may, may show up. Hopefully. If that's the case, then now you have no way to level up your minions, which that's even worse. Then I really don't know what what to do. I guess we can see what's this way. I uh, Zolmu. Oh, we'll try to uh, capture at least one of you. Even though you're water, and I really don't feel like I need the water minion. Too much because I'm really confident Rad Mage, our water minion, turned out really well. 
Stomp. I like your attack. That's cool. One more. There we go. There goes one. What's just a regular attack do? <laughs> Not enough. <laughs> Try this. We'll just use all the mana. That's fine. And then we'll use a liquor afterwards. And that's another thing. The supplies are going to get really scarce if the minions don't come back in this area because then you have no way to get minions to spin cocoons that's really bad well oh, two levels I think yeah two levels so plus 55 HP plus five mana plus three attack two defense one magic attack magic defense and speed good enough I'll take that glad he leveled up twice there's another one before I forget because I'm prone to do that <laughs> we still have this great walnut yay uh, we also have these stat boosting items which if push comes to shove I'll end up throwing these onto one minion and try to make them really good um, Let's see, it gives you 20 mana back. That's okay. Let's fight this one. Hopefully just one? Uh, of course not. <laughs> Alright. We'll just... Work with what we got. There we go. Man, maybe maybe just a few levels matter then because that attack's doing quite a bit more how much magic attack do you get only oh well it counts as an attack not magic you only got three more attacks so maybe just a few points matter more than I thought maybe that's the case but even then To, to balance out all the stats, you'd have to merge quite a few minions. And you got, what, two defense? And that still hit. Hit about the same, it felt like. Okay, that works. I still do want to capture one of these just in case. Good, good. Didn't get hit. Hopefully. Now watch the watch the capture screw up. <laughs> Go. Capture level up to 16. Oh, not immaculate anymore. Rank hero. Nice. Good job, Levant. That's cool. Okay, that's all that way. Oh, I forgot to, to heal. Darn. Well, that's okay. I like that theme. That's nice. You still be able to take one out with little issue. There we go.
And using uh, items in battle is dangerous if you haven't noticed because uh, Levant has to be out to use items. It's not like he can use them from the background here, which that's not too good because then he gets hit. And at this point, he's not taking the hits very well. Not like he used to. He used to take the hits well until, again, we went into the netherworld here. Uh, I guess we'll switch. And we're actually going to capture this one. That way we can turn it into silk for, for supplies. And also so we can hear uh, the new capture tune. So let's do that. Here we go. Like that's got more of a flourish to it. Really to to show his uh his further mastery of of the uh, of the flute. I really like that. Another level. Plus 20 HP, plus 3 mana, plus 1 to all stats. Good. They're level 17. So if these minions do come back, we can get our minions some levels, which is good. And get them ready for whatever boss we have to fight. Fight for this jewel. Let's see. It gives 50 HP and 20 mana. Yeah, that's all the Shabliker gives. So, I mean, at this point in the game, Shabliker really isn't even worth... Worth buying, really. Just because it doesn't give enough HP. The mana is nice, but... The HP. Not too good. Um. So we have two of these guys, but they're a different color, so maybe wind? Oh, we have another thing. Okay. Earth. So I got that wrong. And fire. Wow. That is a terrible matchup, because no matter what you throw out, unless it's one of their elements. You're going to be weak to the other. <laughs> so, for example, if I threw out Radmage, who's water, yes, he does great against the fire minion, but not good against the earth. So, um, I, I, I want to capture both, so that's an issue. Let's can use some mana and we can try to hit the uh, the earth minion let's try to get rid of it wonder if this will actually hit the one that's flying probably not yeah oh thanks for that oh yeah you get to go again because you're stupidly fast Did he just fly away? He escaped? Okay. So help me if he all of a sudden shows up and hits. It'll be just like using fly for Pokemon. Hopefully he doesn't do that. Water attack. Not too bad. Just attack. That's good. Let's try to capture it. Because I would like to merge this with our fire minion. With a pat. Ok. 
capture you. Yay! Sucks that the Earth minion got away, though. So, no experience. Um... Meh. See what's this way. Other than I gigantic chasm that leads to death <laughs> falling from this height it looks like hi that looks like stuff I can pick up so you need to get out of the way let's summon uh, because of the how fast the earth minion is again we're gonna try to get rid of it real quick Come on. Oh, good hit. All right. That's interesting. wonder what that was. Hit again. Here we go. Good. Huh. Is it taking mana? I haven't really been paying too much attention to the mana. Kind of looks like it. That's an interesting maneuver. Because it wasn't doing any HP damage. Ow. Oh, you actually get to go. Ow. Okay. Capture you. Good. All right. And because the Dogle, Dogle is so so slow compared to us, we can get a minion out there. That way, Levant can uh, avoid further hits. And water attack. Go. Let's try out. Valia. See, Red Mage's attack is so high that even though it's weak to to water magic, I think it's just better just to use the water attack anyway, even though it has pretty high defense. If it's just like the uh, uh, Wind One we caught. Level 17. Capture level. Yay! We'll use a mugwort. Two mugworts. Okay, what do we have here? Oh, really? Here, okay. Here stands a very pointed spear. Thunderbolt picked up. Can I pick up this little yellow thing? Or is that just the glare? See, it looked like it was something that you could pick up, but I guess it's just the glare from the uh, sun? Or light? Whatever's over there? Uh, let's check out this Thunderbolt. Uh, tip, tipped with a sharp tusk, can render the enemy helpless. Plus 8 attack, plus 2 magic attack, uh, a little less speed. And for those of you that played the game before, let me know, is how much does Levant's stats matter, other than speed and defense? Because really, I don't feel like you should be attacking with Levant too much at this point in the game because the minions are doing quite a bit of damage and you just don't have the HP to soak it. <laughs> That's the problem with Levant. If he had like 300 HP or close to it like his minions, then it would feel like a more viable option. But since he doesn't, 
Violet, you want speed? That way you can get uh, your captures and your summons in there before the uh, enemy minions go. And you want defense so Levant can take some hits if he has to come in to use items. That's just me. I'm going to throw the Thunderbolt on anyway. That way we can kind of see what it looks like. And if I feel like I need that other uh, three speed, we'll go back to uh, Night Glow. I may go back to Little Bird just for the, just for the speed. So those are my observations. That well, looks really crude. <laughs> it's just crudely made, but it, it's... Somehow this sharp tusk crudely made spear is more effective than anything forged we found or <laughs> you know got like this night glow longsword which is forged this forged sure <laughs> that is one sharp tusk i guess and this just loops around so all that's this way is the spear keep that in mind and we'll move on um how's the steel drag lane doing uh he's got the mana to fight so we'll do that hi you can do a lot of damage with this his hits. Earth attack. Yeah, now two earth attacks and he can and he can get rid of one. Cool. Goes one. And again, I think I'm gonna capture this one for for cash. Because the healing items are expensive, at least the healing items that really, you feel like you can really use. <laughs> like the excellent liquor, just for a lot of HP. Back, I mean, mana, they'll give you all your mana back to me. But uh, the HP is the important thing in a tough fight. Oh, Levant. Nope, not summon. Capture. Like, the excellent liquor is 500? I mean, jeez. <laughs> that could be a lot. It may not be as much as I think. It just depends on how much we get for for silk. We'll find out. Oh, hi. Oh, I guess we'll fight you real quick. Then we'll go back to town, spin, up, uh, spin the silk, and uh, maybe buy a couple of extra items and then end the episode. That's the plan. Maybe do the merging depending on how it affects our fire menu. Earth attack. Yeah. Just because I don't know how much money we're going to get. We'll capture this this minion as well. Switch to Levant. And unlike your minions, Levant doesn't get HP back after every battle, so <laughs> I don't know if I if I ever really went over that. I'm sure you can see that, but. Yeah, 
it's just another another reason I feel like Levant really shouldn't be fighting. So what does the attack matter? Okay. Let's look just a little bit more. I am curious. Huh. Maybe there's something down there? Well, we'll come back. Uh, valuables. I keep wanting to go to use to use the hunter's earring, but... Okay. Hi. I Form Nagi magic. So they'll purify the cocoons. Okay. Let's spin. Okay, wow, we have a... Uh, Four of these. Let's see. 36, 35. You're already worse. We'll spin you. 36, 36, 19, 43, 17. 36, 36, 19. 18. You have more speed. 36. Uh, as much as I like speed, your overall stats just aren't aren't that great. So we'll spin you. We'll spin you two. Sure. And we'll keep the other two for now. Yes. Oh, Joy, you're out of... Fine, here's here's what we're going to do then. We're going to spend some of the older... Older minions. Claw plus accuracy, you know Agni. You don't know anything, so we're going to spin you. Fallus, we already know that. We'll spin you we'll spin you two. We'll keep you. You don't really know anything, so we'll spin you. Though you have some pretty good stats other than the speed, but you, you, and you. Yes, spin those. Sure. It's so weird to me that they can only carry so many cocoons. <laughs> In a game where you collect minions, the fact that you have a limit on the number of minions you can hold, that, that your uh, Nagi person can hold is... I don't know. Hi! About supplies... Sell. Okay. What do we get? Pearl Silk! Uh, from White Cocoon. Gives off a moderate, clear shine. Fourth highest grade of silk. So I guess that's the... Uh, the new minions we spun. The old ones. Here's Lily Silk. Cloud Silk. Thunder Silk. So... Sell that. Those. So you'll get 600 a piece from the new minions. That's... That's not bad, that's one excellent liquor plus, like, a few mugwort. Not the good mugwort, just the basic mugwort. So. Alright, it's a few meta mugwort. I apologize. 
But like bitter mugwort is 500. Oh, the bitter mugwort is 500. The exit liquor is only 200. My mistake. Well, that's okay then. You could buy several. You could buy three excellent liquor for your to use on your minions for every soap. That's not bad. So we're gonna do just that. We're gonna spend the twelve hundred on that to get excellent liquors. Because I'm sure the boss fight, whenever we get to him, is gonna be <laughs> it's gonna be tough. Um, we'll buy a few more meta mugwort to heal uh, Levant. He has to. Um, just one more to maybe use to get ready for the fight. Okay. Thank you. Alright, not too bad, I suppose. We did make some some progress into the force. The level ups are helping. And what I'm gonna do in between episodes is maybe get a few more level level up levels up for the minions. I also wanna see what's this way. What is this way? That is the Kaya Gate. It opens to the way traveled by the one who has chosen darkness. AKA, this is probably the final boss door. That's what it feels like to me. It is not the way for you. Only the one who has chosen darkness may go there. The one who has chosen darkness has already set out that way to the Netherworld. Oh, never mind. Okay, so wait. This is where the the bad guy went. He went through this door, which is the Chosen of Darkness. And this door just happens to be the Chosen of Light. I guess you could see if you look at the uh, serpents up up top, uh, up above each doorway, that this one is, is more, it's more of a lighter color, and this one's a darker color. So darkness, light. Wow. Why didn't you just stop him then, old man? <laughs> Save me the headache. Uh, it's kind of awkward that they're they're going through the same way. Why don't they ever run into each other here in town? Because surely he comes back to get uh, supplies and stuff too, right? You, you may, I would think so if they both go through here. I'm sure you'll never run into him. <laughs> anyway, that's going to do it for this episode. Uh, like I was saying, in between episodes, I may uh, look at the minions, how they're going to merge. Especially the, the fire ones. So I'm going to take a look at that. And if I do any merging, I'll do it on, on screen. So don't worry about that. Uh, next time, we'll continue going through the uh, forest. And... See it, maybe we run into the next boss. So until then, thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Hope you had a lot of fun. I'm Sindra A9. Remember to shoot for the stars and take care everyone.